Welcome to our new features, about the best authors of children books. Jerry Pinkney was born on December 22, 1939, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Pinkney struggled with school early on due to dyslexia. His love for drawing and art started early in life, and his mother encouraged his skills, by signing him up for art classes. Pinkney was never short on pencils to draw with, because his grandfather worked at a pencil factory. Pinkney's first job as a teenager, was working at a newspaper stand. He would pass any idle time, by drawing people passing by or waiting in lines. Eventually, Pinkney caught the eye of a cartoonist, John Liney, who showed Pinkney that art could be a viable career option for him. He attended the Moral Dobbins Vocational High School, and obtained a full scholarship to the Philadelphia Museum College of Art. He later left the college after a few years, in order to start a family with his wife, Gloria. Pinkney started working for a greeting card company in 1960. A few years later, he started working at the Barker Black Studio, where he created his first picture book with Joyce Cooper Arkhurst. It was called The Adventures of Spider, West African Folk Tales, 1964. About four years later, he was able to open his own art studio. During the 1970s, Pinkney worked for the United States Postal Service, by designing stamps for the Black Heritage Series. He also worked with National Geographic, and the National Park Service, by collaborating on the topic of the Underground Railroad. Pinkney has won many awards, including the Coretta Scott King Award, and Caldecott Medal Honor for his illustrations in Mirandi and Brother Wind, written by Patricia McKissick. He loved taking familiar stories and providing a new perspective on them. Many of the stories he worked on were fables and fairy tales. He said I have illustrated over a hundred children's books. The most favorite is always the work in progress on the drawing board, because my strongest feelings about a particular book are tied to the experience of creating it. I love the act of making marks on paper and seeing those marks develop into a picture. My intent and hope is to lead the viewer into a world that only exists because of that picture. Many of these speak to my culture, while other works are based on my experience of being black in America. We strongly encourage you to check out the books he wrote, and illustrated himself, as well as his collaborations with other authors. The Talking Eggs, The Lion, and The Mouse, Little Red Riding Hood, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, I Want to Be, The Patchwork Quilt, and Noah's Ark are just a few of the beautiful stories Pinkney helped tell. Sadly, Jerry Pinkney passed away on October 20, 2021. His richly beautiful artwork and stories will be treasured forever. If you like the books, don't forget to share and like. Hit the subscribe button below, to be notified about great new books. Give your kids an edge, with professional individual teaching. Visit our website saraswadination.com, for more information about our favorable prices, and professional services. Here you will find valuable tips and information about teaching and learning.